Oh, they... I told you, man, not to do it, Hyper White. He had marijuana and all that weed on, man. Oh, somebody probably did flick a cigarette or something. Huh? Let's see. Look at that Right there, like... Early morning in L.A., man. Ah, the smell of brush fire. Oh, we're used to it out here. Good guy, look at that. We in that out of the day. That truck is hawking. This is sounds so good. Watch the breakdown, y'all. Watch that breakdown. Come on, breakdown. Oh, don't break down the fork to the low 60s. Okay, 66, you can break down. Camaro is 650. So anything over 600 horsepower with a supercharge, of course, EK. <laughs> None of that turbo. I don't want to hear that turbo. Even though the bend sound good, but it don't sound as good as the supercharge. So I don't give a about you GTR people, turbo, all of that thing. You know why y'all saying that? Cause you ain't been in the supercharge. <laughs> Me and Ivy, we been in everything. All in one year, we was in everything. You know what I'm saying? Even the Lambo. We was in the Lambo too. We ain't. What ain't? We just ain't been in Bugatti. We ain't drove a Bugatti. What else? We know, probably some of that shit that uh, Manny Cosman got. Pegasus and all of. I ain't been in none of them. McLaren, Lambo. I ain't drove a uh, uh, Cullinan. Oh, right. We've been in them, but I never drove a Cullinan yet. Or, or Don and none of that. But I don't know. I, I want fat. Yeah, I want fat. I drove an M8. Like, if you got a BMW, but you ain't a B M8, <sighs> you ain't doing it in mine. I don't care about M3s, M5, none of that. That just, that's like a guy talking about a scat pack. If I had a scat pack, I would just take the emblems off. I wouldn't even mention it. You know what I mean? I wouldn't mention it until I got a red eye. I think some of us do that. That's, that's just me. I feel whitey, you know what I mean? Back in the day when Mustang came out with 5.0, couldn't have a LX or none of that whack that's lower than a 5.0. What has the world come to? Everybody just, they, they just settling and soft now. You know what I mean? I would walk and ride a bike till I save my money to get a red, red eye, bro. That's, when we went, I didn't know the Dodge game. I had a Dodge, that truck, 5.7, and that was the highest horsepower truck you could get right and I had that but when I got rid of that and got to Porsche and foreign cars I lost track uh, I lost what was going on with Dodge so when we went to that Dodge lot I didn't I was green huh I didn't know Hell nothing yeah. I was like oh I should get a scat pack I called big boy big boy should I get a scat pack he was like hell no they laughed at you that's what a big boy he, he, he said, hell no, they laugh at me if I got a scat pack. So I said, where I get that? He said, the red eye, man. And I said, hold on, this red eye is 60,000 more? <laughs> Ring it up. <laughs> Ring it up. <laughs> That's what I told him. I wasn't settling for no scat pack. I'd rather, hey, if you're young, 18, 19, 20, I get you 21. It's a separate. Anything over there, it ain't in the center. Oh, shit. It's simple as that, man. Look. What, what would an old man look like like me other than something than this? You know what I mean? Come on, man. OG, young G. 
Get your, and it ain't even just about your paper. Credit. Get your, get to get a couple of credit cards. I think I'm going to go far. Get you a couple of credit cards. Well, not even a couple. You get one for $250. Buy some stuff a few times and pay it right off. As soon as you buy it, go the day after, pay it off. Do that a few times, your credit score will go up, bro. You know what I mean? But don't get into those big credit cards, 5000 12 Don't do that, none of that in the beginning. Get you a little credit card, go on Credit Karma, get your credit card, and pay it off like three, four times. That's what I did to get my credit up to an eight something. I, no, I was at a seven eighty or something like that. That's what I did to get mine up. See, I'm giving y'all game, man. A lot of people ain't gonna do this. They go beat around the bush and oh, 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 buy my uh, buy my ebook, and I tell you, <laughs> still beating around the bush because they don't want no. Those type of people don't want nobody to look as good as them or have as much money as them. I don't give a damn. I want all my fans millionaires. I might need a buck from all of y'all one day. You know what I mean? I want everybody rich. Because guess what? I was in a city where everybody was broke and being broke is the root of all evil. That's when motherfuckers do the most heinous, demonics of things when you're broke. It ain't when you got, when you got money, believe it or not, and that's, that's what you, all y'all been taught. Y'all been taught to hate rich people, but the rich people pay the taxes for you to go with no medical, to go to your local hospital and get a surgery done for free. <laughs> you know, y'all y'all think back because your parents they was broke and they taught you like that. Yeah. When I grew up, we respected rich people. The dope dealers was rich. They, they wanted to move to the suburbs. Y'all want to stay in the hood around roaches and uh, bombs and, uh, and, and y'all. But you know the devil. So, bro, you know I was a youth pastor. I never, so I've been watching, uh, his name is uh, Apostle uh, Jennings. Gino Jennings from Philadelphia. Just fell in love with his, uh, the way he uh, preached. So I never even thought about this. I didn't know, did you know there's God's children? Everybody not God's children. You got God's children and the devil's children. Did you know that? Is that in the Bible? Yeah. No, I didn't know that. Yeah. So everybody not God's children. And it makes sense now. Damn. So we've been questioning why God allowing this to happen. And uh, I, even I used to do it. Yeah. There's devil's children. Hmm. And there are more of them. The Bible says it. Google it. And so that right there, I was like, hold on. I never... In my all my time reading the Bible, word for word, I didn't pick up on that. You know what I mean? I always thought that everybody was God's children, but they had will, free will, as right. they call it, yeah. and they able to make their decisions. Yeah, God's children are, but then you got people born to be the devil's children. Deep, bro. So you know what I mean? Trolls and all these people, it's expected. You know, I just called them, uh, I was calling them uh, workers for the devil, devil workers, whatever, you know what I'm saying? That's how I was saying it. But no, it's actually devil's children. So man, stay away from them. And that's the people we see doing handiest crime. Like remember I'd be like, they, be, they remember what I was saying lately? Like people born, like you hear born killers, born, right. they was born to go do that fucking shooting and all that so it's wild like me i feel i was analyzing it this morning i was i am god's child but when i was young i was god's child born but situations caused me to befriend the devil and so i was walking with the devil for a while but i don't feel i was born to be uh uh, the devil's child. Uh, I was a good kid. I was a youth pastor, believed in the Bible. I had questions about it, 
but uh you know I, I know I wasn't and now I know I'm here to work for good not bad hot to try hot to try today man yeah look at him he got this 40 damn <laughs> Pineapple, you no know, that shit, no had it. Oh, no preservative. I never had dried pineapple like this. This is dried Peruvian. Huh? Too dry to me. Oh yeah. I ain't never had dried pineapple like this. It's different. I mean, pineapple. I mean, it's good. It's kind of. It's just, I don't like doing a lot of chewing. Mm. It is hot today, boy. Yep. This is usually the hottest Burbank ever gets. Hmm. 97. Yep. I'm shooting some Kodak Gold right now. Kodak Gold? Yeah. It's like one of their newer, I guess, medium formats. So, I'm going to have you step up just a little bit. Ready? Yeah. One, two. Yeah, that turns out. <laughs> <laughs> Look at what camera is that? This is a Fuji GW690. So the negatives are like six by nine. Oh, when you get it, basically it holds oh, a so lot of information. It's old school. It's old is, school is in that, here. Yeah. Um, I mean, I do shoot digital, but uh -huh. I love the, I just love the feeling of shooting film. But you get a chance so you got to go in and do this. Yeah, you can you either drop it off at a lab. There's a lab in yeah. uh, Glendale. I can drop it off. Oh, I do okay. develop sometimes at uh -huh. home. But um, it's just a drop it off most of them. Yeah, because yeah. they'll scan it, they'll recolor it for you. I mean, I'm 40, <laughs> yeah. but yo, oh, okay, some of the yeah. youngins, they, they jumping back on this film game. So, yeah, yeah, right. To um, be different. Yeah, to be yeah. different. They're bringing, uh -huh. bringing that trend back. But it also hiked up the prices with like trying to buy film. It's, oh, okay, yeah. It's super uh -huh. crazy. But um, uh -huh. other than that, I mean, yeah, all the old school cats are like, yeah, I've, I've been in there, I've been there, done yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's time for that. Uh, Digital game. <laughs> <laughs> to the jailbirds of the world, man. So I remember the days of me being on this bus and seeing all these cars, knowing I was going to not be able to drive a car for years. Depressing, bro. Hell, I think that was the most depressing part about being in prison was this drive. Because hmm. you just see everybody like me. Hey, like, they're going to be like, damn, he about to be our bro. Oh no. <laughs> so that's the first thing that come to dude's mind like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like he about to be out there banging the broads, man. <laughs> In my seven years, I rode, let's see, I transferred from Wasco to Delano, Delano to Tehachapi, Tehachapi to San Quentin, San Quentin to, uh, San Quentin to South Solano. So, and then I went back several times. So I rolled about 10 times. Oh, in court. Let me not forget court. So when we was in court, when I was fighting my case, I would have to ride from Santa Rita to downtown Oakland. And uh, that was a lot. I forgot about that. So yeah, that was just, it was depressing, man. Uh, but you know, don't hey, don't do the crime. You can't do the time. I wasn't depressed like that, but I'm saying that was like my saddest moment, where I reflect and think. And I've never been depressed in my life, uh, so I don't even know what that feel like. Everything for me was just an obstacle and a, a game, to be honest. Uh, are you gonna be able to outsmart yourself? If you are, are you gonna be able to do character flaw adjustments? stuff like that man life is your perspective everybody and everybody you know it's how you raise a lot of it 
most of it is how you raise. If you raise in a family that tell you to uh, be successful, get your money, uh, mind your business, that's the type of person you go be. But yeah, man, don't do crimes, be a good person. And man, we, you know, a lot of lessons in today while we driving, you know what I mean? A lot of lessons. And I'm gonna have a lot of lessons more because, you know, I, I can give y'all a lot more of my knowledge and wisdom than I do, but I try to keep it in entertainment. You know what I'm saying? Hype, I usually just tell, hype, I stress hypey out all the information. You get tired of hearing me talking. You know what I mean? Now it's time for this to do the talking. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. She's the fastest thing on the highway. Oh my God. <laughs> bye bye, suckers, losers. See you later, losers. Oh. Bye bye, bus. Click here to watch another awesome video from Kelly Muscle. And if you support the channel, hit the subscribe button.